are several new nice improvements to the mini window in Fantastic Al 2 for Mac. You can access it by just clicking it on the menu bar or with a keyboard shortcut. You can access the mini window with the keyboard combination control option space. But if you don't like that keyboard combination, you can set your own. I like to use a different one. So I'll go over here to the preferences and select the mini window keyboard shortcut and I use control command F. And then you can see once I've set that up, control command F activates it on my computer. While you're in the mini window, you can navigate around the window several ways. The first is you could just use your mouse to select on a specific date. Um, you could also use the arrow keys. If you use up and down, it moves by day. And if you go right and left, it moves by month. You can also go down to the list of events and just scroll through that. And you can see as I scroll through the list, the calendar view will automatically update. Now to get back to the current day, just go to the top and tap on the month and year, and it takes you right back to the current day. There's a couple other ways you can do that as well too. So let's say I'm down here and I want to go to the current day. If I just hit Command T, it goes to the current date. Um, you can also do that through the gear menu and they have a command there for go to today. Um, another nice option in Fantastic Al 2 is to jump to a specific date. And to do that, uh, there's a couple ways you can do that. You can tap and hold on the month and year at the top of the screen and you can see it opens up that menu. You can also use the keyboard combination shift command T and you get the same thing. And finally, down under the gear menu, you can say go to date. And once again, you get the ability to go to a specific date. While in the monthly view, you can scroll back and forth using the arrow keys. At the bottom of the screen is an icon that you can click on to switch between the reminders and calendar views. You can also click on the center at the bottom to switch between the all calendars and the calendar set views. Calendar sets are an entirely new feature to Fantastic Al 2 and I've got a separate screencast covering them in detail. The gear icon, in addition to giving you the ability to jump between different dates, also gives you the ability to open other windows and access the preferences. At the top of the screen is a search bar where you can search your calendar if you want. And Fantastical still has that excellent text parser that allows you to type just about anything at the top of the window and create an event. I'm going to do a separate screencast on the text parser as well. Fantastic Al 2 also has a new full window view, which you can access from the mini window several different ways. The first is under the gear icon, tapping on open full calendar window. You can also do it with a keyboard shortcut, which is command zero. And you can also do it by option clicking on the icon. Finally, in Fantastic Al 2, you can now drag the mini window off the menu bar and put it somewhere else on your screen. And you can also reattach it just by dragging it back. As you can see, the mini window got some great improvements with Fantastic Al 2. You can learn more at flexibits.com.